Okay, I'm just getting towards the, the centre again. Okay, and I'm just going to show you the same technique that we used for the uh, line paper. Okay, so I'm just going to get it into position. Okay, and then I'm just going to ignore what's there at the moment. Okay, which is this light. So I'm going to take it right to the very end. Okay, don't brush it down because otherwise it's going to crease. Okay, just leave it, it's not going to fall off. We've turned the power off. I'll do this side for you so you can see. Okay, so I've got my knife. And then we go to the point that's closest to me, which is there. Okay, so a nice sharp knife. Okay, I'm just going to make a little nick. I'm going to make three nicks. One there. And again, don't go digging into the light because you'll see it afterwards. Okay, and then I'm going to work my way around it. It's called a star cut, as I've mentioned before. very gentle with my knife, so not to mark the actual ceiling rows. Okay. Just work a little bit more of a joint there. Okay, and when you're putting your joints together, okay, don't just start forcing it over. Okay, you can push the two together. I always like to hold the sponge, just gives me a bit more push together with it. Okay, and I'll come back to these in a second. I just don't want to leave them so that they're sort of dry in. Okay, it's just for a final adjustment at the end. So one side done. is a little bit longer this side so I'm just going to make some nicks actually into the ceiling, ceiling paper not all the way through right now I've made the uh, nicks okay, I'm just going to get my corking board it gently. Okay, don't forget again the power's off. Okay, so I'm keeping it away from these wires in there. And again get your corking board, sharp knife. And then I'm just going to angle it around this. So press with your knife. I quite like these knives, they're quite flexible. Pull. Keeping your fingers well away from the wires. Okay, the reason it's not cutting particularly well is there's a little gap up the top there. It's forcing the paper underneath. Trying to avoid that if I can. And it goes again in that little gap. Okay, right, all I need to do now is just cut the end there, cut the end there so it's nice and tight. Just check my joints. Uh, just make sure that I'm happy with everything and I can carry on and do the rest.